Hey guys, in this video, we'll be exploring the powerful features of Evoto AI Photo Editor. And I wasn't expecting it to be this mind blowing until I tried out its future. First of all, the blemish remover. If you come on under the blemish remover and you move the frequent acne slider all the way to the right like this, voila, all the pimples are completely gone. And this is beyond my expectation. I wasn't expecting it to be this precise and accurate in removing the blemishes until I tried it out. And the result, as you can see, is superb and is done in the most natural way. The next feature we are going to explore right here is the dodge and bone feature because after removing the pimples on your model skin, uh, let's take a look at the before and the after. If you hold the space bar on your keyboard, you can see the before and if you release it, this is the after. Let's zoom in like this. Here's the before. This is all, these are all the pimples on the face. And here's the after. They are completely gone. The next feature we are going to explore is the dodge and bone feature. And if you come right here to the skin retouching section of the portrait retouching, you can see the smooth face skin using dodge and bone. If we move it all the way to the right here, you can see what it does to the image. You can take a look at the before. And here's the after. It does a great job at even in the skin tone and giving your model a flawless look. We can still go on to smooth the face using the face skin smoothing, but moving it to the right, you can see the face is now more smooth. And if you want to also smooth the body so that it goes with the face, you can come to the body skin smoothing and move it to the right like this, and it's going to smooth the body as well. Here was the before and this is the after. Just using this slider, you can see the amazing results we are already getting. There's no other app out there that can give you this kind of mind-blowing, exceptionally beautiful result just using sliders right here. So in Evoto, you can still go on to unify the body complexion if the complexion of the face is different from that of the skin, maybe due to your lighting or maybe due to the color of the makeup different from the skin. Just come right here and move this slider to unify the skin tone of the body and the face. And here is the before and this is the after. Let's zoom in closely, take a look at the before and here is the after. And this result is very, very, very amazing and beautiful. There's this other feature here that is very impressive and I would like to show you exactly how it works. Uh, the facial expression. Under the facial expression, there's this gentle smile slider here. Let's zoom in. Look at this model. If we move the slider to the right, you can see it has this gentle smile to the model and makes her look even more prettier. Here was the before and this is the after. Adjust accordingly. Somewhere around here is just very natural. Here was the before and this is the after. You can see it adds this beauty to the model and it's just amazing. This is not just all, uh, if you take a look at this image right here, for those of you that take outdoor shoots, and then want to change the color of the, uh, of the portrait to another amazing color, you can come right here to the color adjustment. We have the AI color adjustment. You see there's a neutral color adjustment. It gives your image this look. If you don't want that, or if you want to try the other options, you can see them. The olive green theme, the nile blue theme, the warm cinnamon, the arctic blue, the visual impact. And also, if you choose anyone you like, you can still come right here to increase or reduce the intensity to your desired look. And also, you still have the ability to come and adjust the individual slider right here have the ability to adjust it, the temperature, the tint, just like it is in Lightroom and other editing software, you have the ability to adjust it just that. This one will even give you a head start, uh, gives you AI color adjustments. And this is amazing right here. Not just that, there's this beautiful feature I mostly use for my background adjustments. You see this sky replacement right here in Evoto is more powerful than any other sky replacement I've ever seen. So if you come to recommended, you can see 
you can choose from the numerous option right here it's going to max your model from the background and then apply the sky in the most realistic way here was the before and this is the after if you want a sunset and sunrise skies like the golden hour look just come right here and apply it and it gives you this amazing result here was the before and this is the after so with the sky replacement you can see we can adjust the opacity by reducing or increasing it to taste you can blur the sky the brightness the saturation even the temperature we can adjust we can make all these adjustments there's also edge adjustments you can zoom in and then adjust the edge just as you want and here was the before and this is the after and this can just change the whole mode of everything i can use it help set the mode for your image and it's just very powerful and i want you all to try it out and this feature here human color matching the sky you can use it to match the color of the human of the model with that of the sky or using the scenery color matching the sky to match the scene with the sky we also have this other uh, feature i'd like to share with you one of them is the hair remove stray hairs under the hair hair section right here you see the remove stray hairs it's a very powerful feature if you just move this slider all the way to the right all the stray hairs are gone automatically let's zoom in and see here was the before and this is the after look at all these stray hair entering our face here was the before and this is the after just look down here in the shadows here was the before and this is the after this is very impressive and very amazing and also there's this feature right here in the background adjustment slider for a beautiful headshot like this uh, you can easily use the headshot background changer to change the background to whichever color you like and the photo is going to automatically apply the new background for you there's more right here and you can also choose your own backdrop if you load go to your own pictures and uh, anyway you have your background you can just go and select it and apply it just going to use a random background right here and if you just select that background it's going to be applied to your image just like that so that's how it works and it's amazing and i would love you all to try it out also this software has the ability to derinkle your clothing like if you look closely on this clothes you can see there are so many wrinkles on the clothes so if you come to the clothing adjustment right here clothing adjustment and then you move the slider all the way to the right you can see it removes the wrinkles so let's zoom in to see here was the before look at all these wrinkles right here the after they are all gone here's the before all these wrinkles right here the after they are all gone in the most natural and beautiful way also you have the ability you come to this section right here, the portrait retouching in the eyes you can brighten the eye using the brightness slider if you move the brightness slider all the way to the right here in the eye section it's going to brighten the eye here was the before look into the eyes of this beautiful boy here's the after let's zoom in if you hold the space bar you see the before and the after and this effect is amazing now look at the floor of this backdrop there's these dates here and there if you come to the background adjustment and you turn on the clean solid background so it's going to automatically remove all the dates for you here was the before look right here look at all these dates here here's the after before after here was the before here's the after and this is amazing you know if you use any of the traditional softwares to do this it's going to take you hours hours of uncreative works here and there so guys i have these six images to edit and i don't have to manually touch each and every one of them all i have to do right here in evodo is just edit edit the first one as i would like it to be by moving all the sliders the body and uh, you can see the sliders that we have already gone through just move the necessary ones that you think are best to make this image look 
as beautiful as you want them to be so after going through all this process you can still go and use every other features but i just want to show you how it works right here so after applying all this on this particular image and you can see the before and the after here was the before and this is the after after editing this image to test now you take your time and do that the first one edited very well you can save the editing you've done to the, on this image as a preset. Once you're okay with the editing, you can just come right here to save preset. Click on pre save preset, you give it a name. Let's call this pink retouch or pink R, R for retouch. Then we can create a group. Uh, let's leave it on the portrait group. Preset types is portrait. And you can see that uh, the filter under the filter, you can see that portrait retouch is ticked because it's the only place we have applied changes to. So now we can save this preset right here, and it's going to get saved. And see, preset saved successfully. You can now view it under preset. So uh, if you come to this other image that have not been edited, just come right here. You can see there's recommended preset that you can use from. But right now, I want to show you how to apply our own preset. You come to my preset, you come to portrait. I can see pink R. So you click on the pink R preset. And you can see it's processing down here. And voila, it has been applied on this image. Here was the before, and this is the after. This is amazing. And for the other images, you just have to sync this setting. So you hold control and select the other images you want to apply this particular setting on. And then you come down here, you can see sync. You can adjust the settings of the sync on what you want to apply. So we're just going to leave everything here that has been ticked. You save them and then you click on sync and it's going to be synced on the other images. One after the other is going to process and it's going to be synced on the other images. So you can see for the other images, you can see they are before and the after, the before. The before the after the before the after let's zoom in closely the before the after and finally the before the after you can see that Evodo has helped us to edit each and every one of them exactly like we want them so this you can use to save yourself time and uh, you can just sync if the images are up to 100 or 50 or any amount, especially for wedding photographers, it takes so many images. All you have to just do is you come save it as a preset, you apply, and then you sync through the many images, and then you can go on to sleep or do other stuff. So this is very amazing, and I encourage everybody to try it out. The link to get Evo to is in the description. You have free access to all features. No need for subscription or complicated process. Just sign up, log in, and start using. Always free to update the latest version to use the latest new features. You only pay for export. You are only charged when you export an edited photo. Even if you edit and export the same image multiple times, you only be charged once. And if you use the bonus link in my description right now to download Evoto, you are going to get 30 free credits that you can use for the first month of downloading this amazing software. It has a simple pricing. Evoto uses the more flexible credit system. One credit allows to export one edited photo. It's cost effective. Each credit costs a mere four to seven cents. The more you buy, the cheaper they get. By editing with Evoto, you have the time to process additional orders and capture more photos meaning you are going to edit more photos, you are going to attend to more clients because while you're snapping, you photo will be there editing your images for you. It's very cheap. Uh, you, there's no retoucher out there that you're going to pay four cents to edit your image, but if photo that will even do it better than those retouchers out there is just going to take four cents or seven cents depending on how many you're buying and depending on how often you're using a photo. So this is best for commercial and professional photographers it's a time saver for professionals so i encourage you all to try it out use the link in my description right now happy to hear your feedback in the comment section 
Please like this video if you find it helpful. Subscribe for more helpful tips, tricks, and photography tutorials. Happy to be part of your creative journey. See you in another amazing tutorial.